Welcome to my channel. I'm Preston Walker, licensed marriage family therapist. Today I wanted to talk to you about insomnia. Insomnia is something a lot of people experience. 10% uh, of people have long lasting insomnia. I think upwards of like 40% of people experience short term insomnia. Um, this can cause issues with like cognitive problems. Uh, emotionally just we're not all at our best when we're feeling tired um, this is something that is absolutely treatable uh, there's an entire class of uh, therapy like there's behavioral sleep medicine this is this is essentially therapists who specialize in treating insomnia um, now I know Personally, sometimes I give CBT a hard time, but there's absolutely a place for it, particularly when it comes to insomnia. It can be incredibly helpful. So if you experience insomnia and you go to a therapist and it doesn't seem like they quite understand insomnia or you're not getting, you're not feeling any different, um, you can see a specialist, even if it's just a few sessions. Most uh, cognitive behavioral therapy for sleep disorders are not like months. It's, you know, a handful of sessions, maybe 10 sessions and you're done. It's something that is treatable. So if you experience insomnia and you're not getting any benefit from what you're currently doing, yeah, you can see someone who specializes in it um, to look up those who who do specialize in it there's people who are licensed in multiple states uh there i believe there's apps now where therapists kind of like maybe better help but better reputation uh where it's specifically for insomnia or sleep disorders and they are trained specifically in cbt to help that thing there's access now to to therapy like there has never been access before so if you struggle with insomnia or a sleep disorder, behavioral sleep medicine may be something that can help. Um, but also, maybe you'll go there. Maybe you'll do an assessment and then maybe it might be something that you'll be referred to like uh, a doctor for and to do like a sleep study essentially. So sleep disorders can be treated on one hand behaviorally but then also by doctors who specialize in that thing um, in which case a sleep study would be merited so i hope this has been helpful if you have insomnia there's treatment that's available look into it i hope it helps thank you for your time